Wendy's Pop Burger ASMR I'm gonna eat a burger on a stream because I was bored but I was also hungry and I thought I would eat a pub burger with you guys. What's going on, everybody? My name is Vinny. Let's <laughs> says you're finally doing it. Oh, yes. It's been so long since I've had one, too, guys. It's been a long time. Do I like burgers? I love burgers. I love you, Ramos. I, I, I would say I love burgers as much as you love Ramos. Uh, hi, Wild Style. This is unexpected. Making a random stream about eating a burger. Oh, yeah. And fries. We have fries, too. Well, Michael, you see, this is what's up. The Wendy's Bacon Pub Burger. Uh, so here's the deal, guys. Um, if only Dennis was here. If only. I, I would love... I, Dennis needs to try this burger. He can't, I, I don't even know if it exists in Japan. Uh, I have a Wendy's addiction. That's true. I haven't had this in like two months though. So here's the thing. So uh, the Wendy's that is closest to me, uh, I, I, I'm not sure what they're, what's been going on there. But every time I've driven by, their open sign has just been off. And the drive through line has been like in the street. Like in a very busy s city street. And so, um, I haven't had Wendy's in a long time because I'm like, what's going on there? D dark times over there. Uh, but, um, I found out there's one that's almost equidistant to my apartment. <laughs> uh, so I went there and there was literally no line. So here we have a bag of Wendy's. Our breakfast could have been free, but not our dinner because that's what we're eating right now. Can we play a random game while you eat? Or is it just a Q and A stream? I mean, you could play a game. My hands are gonna be greasy. Can I play Among Us? Oh, maybe. It was fake for you to get one of these, clearly. Oh yeah. Hmm. Hmm. I'm gonna have Wendy's fry in a hot minute. That's good. I like the cut of a Wendy's fry. I like the cut of your fries, Wendy. Is the burger a spy? I hope. Oh, well, I hope not. Uh, Wendy's needs to sponsor this. You're awesome, man. Play a game. Risk comes with rewards, says Jazzy. I don't want to grease up my equipment here, man. This is already, I, I don't typically eat in my office. This is already a, a risk. It is greasy. It is, like, I, I'm just touching the foil of the burger. It's greasy. How are all you guys? Anybody got, uh, anybody also have, um, a burger or anything that we're, that, that, that you're eating? Uh, Mephilus the Dark Falcon says, good choice of burger place. This is, this is one of my favorite burgers ever this thing's good man i've been eating it for like a year now actually i think i think it's been around for about a year now it was fire season i remember that because the smoke was in the air and uh i i made the trip to wendy's <laughs> through the smoke and uh and i got a burger it's it's greasy it's very greasy this so here we have this is this is our foil wrapper of, of the pub burger. It's not in focus, but I don't want to touch my camera. <laughs> I came in to say hi. I was not prepared for Wendy's ASMR. That's what that's what you should be prepared for, man. Uh, if I had my way, this would, this would be the only thing I ever streamed. It was me eating a Wendy's pub burger. Okay, so let's, let's unwrap her here. Oh, yeah. It has Munster cheese. If I could describe the smell, it would be, um, it's actually kind of pretzel forward. It, it is the pretzel bacon pub burger. So there is a pretzel bun, uh, bacon, crispy bacon. You can see it poking out over there. Uh, we've also got some like crispy onion straws, 
uh, Munster cheese, beer cheese, uh, like a honey mustard on there, uh, pickles, and of course, uh, I get it double, so we get two all Angus never frozen uh, beef. Witch in Black says, Stream title, I'm eating a Wendy's pretzel bacon pub burger. Ask me anything. Me. This is the quality content I come to YouTube for. Oh, yeah. Here's a challenge. Describe that burger as if you were a Michelin star chef. It is robust. Yet nuanced. Holly the Girl Hedgehog of Chaos says, Hi, Vinny. I like your Sonic pictures. Oh, thank you. Uh, starting uh, starting with this one, that's a Sonic the Hedgehog movie poster that was given away at Regal Cinemas. And then, to my left of it, is the Sonic Adventure 2 uh, vinyl record edition and underneath that is Sonic Super Special 13 from the Archie comic series this was a um, adaptation of Sonic Adventure it's got a great cover by Patrick Spaziante and then to the left of that one uh, would be a oh I forgot who did that picture Oh no, I got it at Sonic Revo. I oh no, I totally forgot who made it. Um, but it's uh, it's Sonic in his like OVA outfit that the old man owl steals. Uh, and then next to that is the one in ten uh, incentive cover for the Sonic 30th anniversary special. Underneath that is uh, the Sonic Mania vinyl record. Uh, in front of that is my new First Order Stormtrooper helmet, and then. Uh, to my left of Sonic Mania is a picture that my friend made of of me uh, based off of my video where I, I, I make the Archie Comics chili dog recipe. I'm making you hungry. We'll make you even hungrier if I told you how delicious and gooey the cheese is. Hmm. Zariah asked, is Opie my favorite cat? Of course. Who's better than Opie? I challenge you to find a cat better than Opie. Uh, answer wisely, Vinny. What is under your hat? My hair. <laughs> Sweet asked if the Where I music is on in the background. Yeah, I've got... I've got a playlist of uh, the night music from Sonic Unleashed going. Only real friends would eat on the internet like this. I, I hope that somebody out there is like eating food while watching this. And so it's like we're having a meal together, you know? It's just, uh, just, just good times, you know? You have any? My cat is better than Opie. Okay, everyone's gonna say their own personal cat's gonna be better. Yeah, okay, so if we took Opie out of the equation, <laughs> sounds like we're killing him. Let's not kill my cat, but eh. if I couldn't choose Opie, if I couldn't choose a cat that I owned, um. My uh, my good friend Garrett had a cat named Missy, and she she would probably be uh, up there in my echelon of, of cats. Although Steven Steven's cat Jazz is another uh, popular popular uh, vote. What's up, Steven? What game is this? Uh, this is the Wendy's Bacon Pub Burger. Vinny would choose Simba. If uh, that's a big cat, I'm thinking house cat. You would choose Garfield. Never case that. What kind of cereal are you eating?
What if Wendy? What if Wendy's? I lost my train of thought. <laughs> oh my god! No, it's back. So I was enjoying the burger so much. I was like, "Oh yeah, it's been a while." What if Wendy's made a breakfast cereal? Do you think it would be like? Do you think it'd be like based off of the nuggies, chicken nuggets, or would it be based off of like the fries? Cinnamon toast crunch. Oh, yum! That's a great cereal. That is like. That's definitely got. That's got to be top three cereals of all time. What's my favorite kind of water? I drink a lot of Kirkland brand water. No, make pub burger cereal. That'd be gross. I won't lie to you. Pub burger -os. Oh. <laughs> Thinking about like this flavor being condensed into like a like a little like puffed corn sweetened thing. Supernova said, ha, I just had Wendy's today, too. Nice. Did you, What'd you get? What'd you get at Wendy's? Jack, Jackalope says, is that the burger they were advertising with the t-shirt? Yeah. I talk about this burger all the time. It's like, <laughs> yes, Gan, I am enjoying my burger. I, I talk about this burger all the time on my streams, because, like, a lot of times, you know, I stream late. And then I'm like, okay, I, I don't have any energy to cook. And so I go and get this. Or uh, or other <laughs> greasy fast food. Uh, but this is a popular choice. Uh, the Wendy's bacon pretzel bacon pup burger. Uh, it has Munster cheese. I saw Vinny's tweet about the pretzel bacon pup burger and I came as soon as I heard. Well, thank you. Thank you, KN. That's how you know you got a good friend. Is they hear you're eating a burger on the internet and they come and hang out. <laughs> Have you ever tried the chicken version? No, I almost did it this time though. Um, Cause uh, w when I started not being able to, to go to Wendy's, I was like, I, I was wanting that I was wanting to try the chicken version, but it had it'd been so long. I had, I had to, I had to do this. I came immediately to support the burger. Oh yeah. This bike goes out to you, Cam. I mean, do you like cold, room temperature, or warm water if you're feeling fancy? You gotta have it cold. Um, yeah, no, you got you gotta drink water cold. There, there is merits to drinking warm water. You, uh, you'll process it faster. You'll hydrate better that way, but. Um, this is, this is taste better when it's cold. More refreshing. <laughs> Super Epic Toad Bros. Plush Production says, That's a continent over! Mitchell says, Vinny, I didn't know you were streaming today. I didn't either until I walked in the door and I was like, You know what? Let's, let's eat with the internet tonight. Whew. Imagine if Wendy's paid you to do some product placement. Everybody needs to get paid, am I right? <laughs> it would be really funny because, like, thinking about, like, product placement for a streamer when it's something like this. Like, would I just have, like, half-eaten burgers? Like, prop burgers everywhere? Or would it be, like, a bunch of Wendy's, like, like, uh, it, like all the Sonic signs back there are all Wendy's? That'd be funny. This is actually going to be turning back into my music corner soon. Uh, cause that's what it actually is. Um, oh jeez. I'm in the perfect position to just cover this up. Yep. Uh, that's my, it's my, actually my turntable. And all my records are down there. Also, today was record store day, everybody. I hope that, uh, if you're, if you're into music, you had a, well, first of all, if you're into music, I hope that you have a record store in, in your area that you're able to go and support. But uh, Record Store Day is, is an awesome thing they do once a year. Um, 
where they uh, a bunch of artists put out um, limited release stuff, and uh, you can go and get some cool, cool albums and and stuff like that. Um. Anyway, um, yeah, uh, that that's typically got like Foo Fighters stuff and Pearl Jam and other stuff over there. Um, but I, I switched it up for Sonic's birthday. Made it a little sh Sonic Shrine, temporary Sonic Shrine. Um, but uh, yeah. What if I had what if I had to make werehog noises every time I ate food? Rachel says, and I'm getting a Wendy's tomorrow. <laughs> nice. I recommend the Wendy's bacon pub burger. <laughs> mm, sweet says my room is a Sonic Shrine. Yeah, this whole room is pretty much a Sonic Shrine too. But uh, you know, I, I like to make so like this whole wall right here is all um, it, it's like it's it's floor to ceiling, just stuff I like. Um, I like to I like to put photos of things that I like around me, so I can like constantly look and make eye contact with something and smile and yeah. Uh, like like right uh above me is actually a big poster of Sonic Unleashed. And then right above that is a picture of me and Mr. Incredible at uh, Disneyland. <laughs> um, hi, Vinny. How was your day, dude? By the way, we're eating the same burger. Kimosabe, are you eating one right now? Dude, burger cheers. Burger cheers. Huh? Ah! Um, I'm doing great. I was telling everybody... I'm um, this morning I went to, uh, I went to the record store. I got, actually, so record store day, all these things are limited releases, right? So most of the time you each store doesn't get very many of each release. So you might not get all the ones that you want. And, um, I, I pulled up today and I was, uh, I think it was fourth in line. I got there like a half hour early. Um, and, uh, it was the very first time where I got, I, I, I make a little list of like the top three things that I want. And I'm, and I'm always like, if I get one, great. If I don't get any of them, that's fine. I'm sure there's still something I'll pick up while I'm out. Um, but this time I got my top three things that I wanted. I got all three things. So, so when did the bacon pub burger meme start asking me, um, I think it just started because I was talking about it all the time. I've been eating the burger for over a year. So. I just always talk about it because I get hungry after my stream. And this is like one of the things I get all the time. Getting that Vinny ASMR. Oh, yeah. Mmm. Mmm. This bite is gonna have a pickle in it. I'm so sorry I tagged Wendy's on Twitter for you on a whim. Are you gonna watch this and be like, we get so much money out of this clown? <laughs> You've got the pickles! Still no pickles! Shout out to Bubble Bass. Everyone's favorite SpongeBob character. <laughs> You're not eating your food with ranch or ketchup? I don't dip. I don't typically dip. Um, there's... There, it's very rare that I'll I'll uh, I'll I'll dip. Um, a lot of local places when they've got like a like their own sauce, I'll dip then. But I never am like the only time I'm dipping is if I've got a a, a McDonald's McNugget because those plain are gross. But like the Wendy's nuggets, ten out of ten with no sauce. I'll I I'd eat like thirty of those just plain.
Maybe we can summon Wendy's in our minds. Well, hey guys, here's the thing, guys. Wendy's is always with us, okay? Wendy's is always right here. Right in your heart. Right here. Dr. Burger? Yeah, um... Hi, my name's Vinny Burger. Dr. Vinny Burger, MD. And there's the pickles from last time, too! Yeah, heart disease! Woo! <laughs> well, and in your stomach. You're right. Well, currently, it's in my stomach, but, uh... <laughs> no, it's in your arteries. That's... I mean, that's still your heart, you know? They, they flow into your heart. Huh? And there's my car keys. God, so life says I'm back with water. Guys, make sure you're hydrating. It's summertime. Drink a lot of water. Cheers. I'm gonna drink Coca-Cola. Vinny's the Professor Pickle of the Earth, but it's Professor Pub Burger. <laughs> Wait, hold on. Vinny is the Professor Pickle of the Earth, but it's Professor Pub Burger. Oh, like, I'm like, I'm this universe's Professor Pickle, but I call myself Professor Pub Burger. 10 out of 10. <laughs> I love that the chat has devolved into <laughs> the script of of that episode of Spongebob. Timothy Steele asks, Hey Vin, if you had the power, would you make Sylvae's canon? Um, sh sure. <laughs> Those are two characters that, I mean, they put enough, um, they put enough chemistry in, into them, like, they kind of, uh, they kind of really tease that romance in 06, so, sure. Why not? Huh? I don't really, I don't really ship characters. But. I feel like that, that'd make a lot of people happy. And Jolly Snowman says, alright, got my water bottle. Nice. I mean, water is really important to a snowman. That's all I'm saying. Like you, you, and make sure your water's like extra cold. Yeah, Opie's meowing outside the door. I fed him right beforehand, but he hears me talking, so he just he just assumes that I'm gonna give him more food when he hears me talking. <laughs> Do I have a? favorite moment of streaming the past year um it's gonna sound bad but like the bad parts always stick out so much more like if if i had like a really bad technical difficulty that's what sticks out um but uh that montage i did was sort of was was sort of my favorite parts i i think uh i i think if i had to choose one it would be um when we were playing sonic 06 and i like launched rouge into space somehow <laughs> I, I was i was dying um can i can i show us the cat i will once i finish the burger i don't want i don't want to just like rub greasy hands on him and then pick up you know all the cat hair with my greasy hands and then put that cat hair onto my food and then eat it but i will i will i'll give him a treat on on the on the, on the uh what's done here Huh? Rouge in space. I mean, she's been to space, but I don't think before that she had ever been launched into space from just stepping on a bridge in the middle of Italy. <laughs> Mm, sweet says my favorite part was near the end of a stream and Shadow was just losing it over the money. Oh yeah, the um the uh Winter Olympic Games. When it gives you all that money but it like means nothing. Yeah. Yeah, that was pretty funny. 
Lindsay and Jake Kangaroo Mouse. I hope you have a great day. Goddess of Life, I'll dedicate that Opie Crunch to you, of course. Happy, happy early birthday. Hope you have a great day. I love this one. Is this, uh, what is this one? Is this, uh, Chanan? This one's good. Huh? When Silver was doing the Tass in 06, the kids in the ring one. That one got dark, but that was fun. That was funny. First Frosting asked what I think of Chaos Zero and Takal. Um, KN, if, if you're still here, can attest that I said Takal's name, Taikal, for most of my life. And one time I said it while we were recording an episode and everyone made fun of me. Uh, <laughs> indeed. <laughs> um, I, I love Chaos Zero's design. I have a plushie of Chaos Zero. I think Chaos is a really cool idea. Uh, <laughs> Vinny was saying her name weirdly and we all thought he was memeing, but no, he was serious. My bad! They say her name out loud, like, what, once? <laughs> serious question, what are my opinions on the cookies with icing on them? Trash. They're trash. The, the, you're talking about, like, the ones that are just, like, garbage, like, seven-day-old cake with pink frosting on them? Trash. Wendy's Pub Burger, 10 out of 10, though. I'm with that. I've eaten the Pub Burger. You were saying it like Thai Cal. Yeah. That's how my brain told me to say it. I'm sorry. Monster cheese. To call. Right? Steven, it's so funny you bring that up because I saw the birthday kick Oreos at uh, Fred Meyer the other day. And I was going to tell Julie this story. Uh, years ago, eons ago, uh, Steven got some birthday cake Oreos. And I don't remember which way I did it. But I I think I ate... I, I love the Oreo cookie. Like, I love the cookie part of the Oreo. And I think what I did was I removed the cream of each Oreo and I left it in the thing. But I ate all of the cookies. 10 out of 10 move. Mission accomplished. Rank A. How? Oh, we got some french fries to eat, and then I'll go grab Opie. <laughs> Vinny, why? Because the cream was too rich. The disrespect. I'm sorry, man. The cream was too rich. The cookie, though, just right. <laughs> oh, yeah, I'm a cookie over cream guy all day. For an Oreo, yeah. Hope he sounds like he's doing good. Hold on. I gotta finish these fries, though. Because, like I said, I don't want to... I don't want to have his hair all over my hands. Honk, 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 honk. Just inhale these. 
Do I have milk with the cookies, Vinny? No. I'm not... I'm not super into milk. There's very few times where I'd just be like, yeah, let's have some milk. The library or Oreo commercial? I don't think I've seen that, Alexia. Dylan is streaming. Tell him hi. I'll go, I'll go into his stream after this. What's next? Ask the Shadow Heroes? Right now. Um, um. Bye, Holly. Thanks for watching me eat a burger. Make sure to wash your hands before you pick up Opie. Yeah. Okay, I think I've successfully eaten everything that's edible. Oh, wait a minute. Yeah? Yeah? All right. Great. Okay. Now let me go wash my hands real quick. <gasps> Jazz Millen, what's up? Best stream of my life, 10 out of 10, now I'm hungry. You're welcome. All this trash out of here. All this trash out ghoul. There's something glorious about watching a man eat a burger, especially when you didn't expect it. Well, as we say in the Big Brother house, expect the unexpected. You guys watching Big Brother this season? Who you rooting? Who you rooting for? I'm root. I'm rooting for Big D. I want to see him. I want to see him go far. Surprise, Muckbank. <laughs> okay, let's go grab. What's Big Brother? Big Brother is a reality uh, game show where a bunch of strangers stay in a house together for the summer and they compete in games and evict each other from the house. It's garbage television. Uh, but I liked I like garbage things. You know, I just ate a greasy burger on the stream, so you know I like trash sometimes. Uh, okay, so let's wash the hands and then pick up the Opie boy. And uh, show off the chaos plush. What else did I say I was going to do? Okay, I'll be right back. I'll be right back. Don't move. Uh, nobody move. Uh, no, nobody. No, nobody move. Oh, he's laying down over there. I saw his shadow right here. So he had to have just ran over there before I opened the door. Anyway, I'll be right back. This is my OP boy. This is my OP. Ladies and gentlemen, OP cat. <laughs> I love this OP boy. Give him by a cushion. Uh, this is my cat OP. He is a flame boy in Siamese. We got him from the shelter, so his official name is Shelter Cat. Yeah, that's right. You're, that's right. Your 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 actual name is Opie Rodriguez, <laughs> is what we call him. Uh, let's let's give you, let's give him a treat. Let's give him a treat. 
Opie, it's goddess of life's birthday. You gotta have a treat. Don't be humble about it either. Give us a crunch. Did you just, like... Oh, there it is. Well... Indeed. Cute, cute, cute. Cute, cute, cute cat. Huh! Opie. You guys have any questions for Opie? Treat time with Opie's. Is there a case that? Oh, yeah. Doss of Life says thank you. He says you're welcome. Raise Opie up like Simba. Oh, he won't like that. I'm not, I'm not taking that risk. <laughs> He's got claws, everyone. He's got claws. What microphone do I use? It's a Marshall V87. Uh, it's actually, uh, it's, it's from my friend Steven. I have a question. Can I hug Opie? Of course you can, Jose. Take him. I don't, I don't want him anymore. Just take him. <laughs> yeah, I would never give you away. I'm sorry. Scratching post or sofa? <laughs> he has a new scratching post. We got him a new one. He sometimes he uses a sofa, but he's been very bad. We do that. Most of the time, it's to get my attention. He knows that it's bad. And so if he's like, You haven't fed me in 45 minutes. I'm scratching the couch. And then I'll be like, Hey! How are you after the war? Uh, he, he's doing good. He's, he's, uh, he actually didn't need any therapy, is what he told me anyway. Um, but, uh, you know, he's, he's doing well enough. Uh, he defeated Infinite, so go Opie, I guess. What would, what would you dress up as Batman or Shadow for Halloween? Uh, I think Opie's actually gonna be a Loki for Halloween this Halloween. Uh, we'll see. How old is he? We don't know. We got him from the shelter, so we have no idea. Um... I would guess Opie is like maybe seven, maybe maybe even six. We'll go with six. Who would win, Opie or Shadow? I, Opie has not demonstrated that he has uh, chaos powers, so probably Shadow the Hedgehog. <laughs> um, but uh, I don't know. I don't want I don't want to pit my cat against the ultimate life form to find out what's Opie's Hogwarts house probably he's probably a Hufflepuff would you would you say you're a Hufflepuff maybe Gryffindor because he's a cat you're laying on me like a tree man <laughs> anything else anything else Opie, I will squeeze you. I will kiss you. Has Opie ever done cat tricks? He's never done anything like exceptionally crazy. He plays fetch. Um, so like sometimes he'll like run up to me and just like drop his little uh, his little mouse toy, and we play fetch. I don't know. Opie feels like he has big, big energy. So it'd be an even fight against Shadow. He is a chungus. That's for sure. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, Opie! Alright. Back to the hallway with you, buddy. We love you. We appreciate you. Thanks for stopping by the windy stream. Good day. Um, Chaos Plushie, that's right. Chaos Zero is a plush. This is what it looks like. This is a, this is a GE plush. Um, Produced in December of 2014, according to the tag. 
Uh, but yeah, it's a, it's a good looking plushie. It's a neat thing. It's an item I am happy to own. Um, but yeah, I love chaos. I need more content of him. I'm just too lazy to make it. Uh, excuse me. Hello, my name is Chaos. More content of me, please. Thank you. Yeah, it, it definitely is, uh, is... Somehow his design, uh, you know, works really well as a plush. I like it. It's, uh, it's, a. Uh... It's one of a few plushies in my collection. Chaos doesn't talk. What do you mean? He, ju he just talked. We all heard him. Is Shadow's favorite Oreo flavor red velvet? Probably Cole. He's very vain. So, if something is his color scheme, then... Uh, he's probably into it. Hi, Rose. How are you? Super Silver Leo 6 says, You are an amazing voice for Shadow. You portray him so well. He's definitely the coolest. Oh, thank you. I appreciate that. I don't, I, <clears throat> I don't think I'm the best, but I will take the compliment. I appreciate it. Thank you very much. Ooh, there were Sonic Tails and Knuckles plushies and a claw machine. I tried to get one, but claw machines are rigged. Yeah, they're they're def definitely difficult. Um, actually, when I was a kid, I tried to get a Sonic plushie out of a claw machine and failed. And I was, like, really upset about it. It was before I really became a Sonic fan, too. But I vividly remember it. Oh, well. Eventually I got one. <laughs> If you could ever enter a game show, which show would you like to go on? I'd like to, I would like to go on Big Brother if it didn't mean all of these super fans stalking my life forever afterwards. That's always the catch twenty two, you know, is 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 people harassing people you know. Um, are you excited for the Mecha Sonic figure and the Death Egg Robot figure? Uh yeah. I'm probably going to get both of them. I'm trying to limit my purchases. Because <laughs> I get, I keep getting toys and stuff. And I'm like this Stormtrooper helmet. I, I was so excited for it. And then I was like. Where am I going to put it? <laughs> uh, I would want to go on Legends of the Hidden Temple. Bring it back. Can I would go on Legends of the Hidden Temple. What are we going to be? Are we going to be the Silver Monkeys? Or what, what team would we be on? And here I am struggling just to find a Sonic plush. Well, Rainy, it's soup. I mean, like, the internet has made it easier than ever, luckily. Um, but at the same time, you get the scalpers. So, uh, so like, you, you know, you, when they're in a Target or something, everybody's buying them up and then resell them on eBay, which. Don't be a scalper reseller, guys. Don't do that. That's mean. Am I gonna get that shadow figure too? I um I already have the Jack specific shadow. Um he's not in here. I have him actually he he's on my patio. He's in a he's in a planter on my patio. Uh when I sometimes when I get figures, I don't like I don't put them in here. I I put them like I make like a small terrarium and put them with plants. So much for Sonic says we don't have Vinny says, yeah. If someone tries to buy out all your merchandise and resell it for profit on eBay, that's no good. I wanted that glowing Silver the Hedgehog figure slash statue. Too expensive, though. Uh, the Like, the first four figures statue, because right now they have a Super Shadow statue, and then they also decided to do a regular Shadow statue that's based off of their Super Shadow statue. And it is the coolest thing in the world, and I would love to own one, but it is $500, <laughs> and it is huge! I have no idea where I put it! Again, I, I... It's so cool, though. It lights up. It's amazing. 
Does anyone here remember the Brain Drain game show from Nickelodeon? No. What is that? The bra you know what? That that makes me think of We're Back, a dinosaur story. Um, what is that called? The cereal that they eat to become smart dinosaurs. What is that called? <laughs> on my kitchen counter. I don't. I wouldn't want gunk getting on it. If I could do another Sonic character reads musical script, what show would you do and who would read it? I don't want to. I don't want to rope myself into reading another musical. <laughs> it was so much fun, but it was also like a very daunting thing. Uh, it was called Brain Search. I see. Um, if I had to do something like that again, though, I don't know. A lot of the musicals I, I like are a little raunchier. Hamilton is like just barely, you know, if you cut out a couple of lines, it's PG-13. The first act, anyway. <laughs> the second act is more difficult. <laughs> um... <laughs> What do you do on your kitchen counter that gets that that gets that dirty? I make food. You're gonna if you're if you got something in a pan, it's splattering. Oh, the Beetlejuice musical? Me, Dennis! You! You missed me eating a bacon pub burger. Um What's Sonic? Do I like besides Shadow? Like, character? All of them. Dennis, I already ate the pub burger. But I did do it without you. Um. If I had to choose one, I, I don't know. Eggman? Sonic? <laughs> I don't know. It's hard. How about Jet and Shadow read the Goofy movie script? 100% would do that. I would totally do that. That would be fun. Maybe next year we'll do another charity thing for that. That would be fun. Um, so, like, the stretch goals for that, when I was like, okay, let's do some song covers as Shadow, I was like, how hard could that be? But I'm super critical of myself now, and so every time I record one, I'm like, no, that's not it. I've done, like, I've done 15 takes, 15 full takes that I've been like, okay, let's listen through it anyway. And, and I, I don't know, I might need to, I might need to do something a little different with it. Or just release them and have them be bad, because, I mean, like, no one's expecting Shadow the Hedgehog to be a good singer anyway. <laughs> You think I'm in trouble, Hugo? I'm in trouble? What'd I do, Mom? What'd I do? Rainy says, as a person who likes to do song covers, I can relate. I've never, like, you know, recorded one, like, seriously, anyway. And I mean, like, it's not really serious, because I'm doing it as a character, but... Shadow reads The Lion King. <laughs> Uh, I have played Dance Dance Revolution. I used to have it on my original Xbox. I was never very good at it. Uh, I also actually had the Mario one for the GameCube. I might have gotten that second hand. I don't know if I ever actually owned the pad for the Mario one. I might have just always played that with the controller. Big the Cat reads the script to cats would be the most hilarious thing, actually. Oh my god, Kimberly, that would be really funny. <laughs> There's so many weird nonsense words that I would love to hear come out of Big the Cat's mouth from that show. That would be funny. I'd like to hear Team Money 2 sing Put On Your Sunday Clothes from Hello Dolly. Maybe someday. You never know. <laughs> Do a performance of Shadow the Hedgehog 2, the musical. <laughs> oh, 
classy says hey Vinny I first found your channel from those Sonic story videos and I just came back to your channel will you ever do any of those again um, I get asked this a lot because um, I mean it makes sense because they're the videos that are popular here um, I, I, I've kicked around the ideas of what I could do with one for Sonic Mania and make it work with what I'd already done um, but it, it, it kind of comes down to uh, they're, they're huge time commitments um, and uh, I, I I just have to if if I want to do it is the other thing you know if if I if I feel strongly enough about about making another one it'll happen I it almost happened this year I won't lie to you I did I did kick around with it for a little bit um, earlier this year I thought about releasing it for the 30th anniversary and then um, I I decided to uh, n not do that because I didn't have any time to commit to it. <laughs> Um, I am working on a a, uh, a short animatic uh, based off of a script that I wrote, though. Um, so that that will sometime happen on this channel. I just got to draw everything for it. This is the first time we've been streaming at the same time. I think Dennis. Are you are you watching my stream on your stream right now? You insane man. I love the pretzel bacon pub. Dude, it's so good. I wish I had another one so I could eat it again. I did eat the burger, man. I I ate it Zion rewind the video you'll watch me <laughs> it was good yes and minecrafting because i love you so hold on you're streaming are you streaming minecraft or are you <laughs> are you streaming a different game playing minecraft at the same time as the other game you're streaming and i'm watching me stream nothing I order it every day after work. Every day. That's intense. I have had it more than one time in a week, though. So, I understand. Yeah, Hugo. Wendy's is, is, is the best. My chat told me to come here and how you ate without me. <laughs> I'm sorry, I didn't realize I had to check in with you every time I, I go to eat food Dennis uh, can you feel the sunshine where I live we only have KFC Burger King and Wendy's our McDonald's closed down long ago rest in peace McDonald's that's a weird I wouldn't expect McDonald's to be the one to go that's interesting How many pub burgers can I eat in one sitting? One. There's no way. Um, although I get them double. I, I always get it with two patties. So if I maybe did... Uh, but even then, it's still pretty filling. The pretzel itself is filling. So you got that dental plane. <laughs> so Opie would win against Hyper Chaos Shadow with his hands behind his back at 1% power. Opie is pretty powerful. Try Australia. We don't have Wendy's at all. None in the entire... Really? Austra I'm Googling it now. Australia. Wendy's. Oh, Wendy's milk bar comes out. That's not the same thing. They got some delicious looking ice cream, though. At Wendy's Milk Bar. Wow. Oh, hold on, hold on. Wikipedia's got some lore for me. Hold on. What did I just... What did I see out here? In the 1970s, Wendy's opened in Australia, but by 1986, almost all of their dot dot dot... Their what?! 
What is it? But by 1986, almost all of their Australian stores were purchased by Hungry Jacks, the Australian franchisee of Burger King. On, thir on the 13th of May 2021, Wendy's opened a pop-up store at The Rocks in Sydney's, Sydney's, Sydney's city center for a day. You had Wendy's there for one day this year in, in Sydney, if you're even close to Sydney. Wow. That's gotta, I mean, like, if you don't know what you're, I, I'm sure you have plenty of other options over there. <laughs> I'm like, that's gotta be hard. <laughs> There's plenty of worse things. <laughs> uh, getting deep into the Wendy's lore. Should I just read the Wendy's Wikipedia? Oh, well, I think it might be time to hit the dusty trail. I had so much fun eating and hanging out and chatting with you guys. What time do I go to bed? Uh, I typically go to bed at like one in the morning. It's probably like my average. Sometimes, um, sometimes it, I, I'll be working on a project and then, uh, all of a sudden it's like three or four and I'm like, what have I done? <laughs> But I would say on on average, um, I would I probably uh, go to bed at like one a.m. <laughs> Did I really come in at the tail end of your best stream ever, CJ? Rewind it. Watch me eat. Challenge me to go to bed at nine. Sometimes I go to bed early. Sometimes I, I do like a like a 10 p.m. Um, I wouldn't be able to fall asleep at 9, though. I don't typically get done with work until 7, and I get home around 7.30. And um, I would need more than an hour and a half to unwind. Uh, Josh says, yeah, man. It was nice to just chill with you, Vinny. Also, do same. I stay up so late working on stuff and not realizing what time it is. Yeah. Yeah, you know, sometimes, like, you get done with, like, with, like, work work, and then you come and you work on, on other work, that like, like, fun work to unwind, and then you're like, oh, I, I just never turned my brain off. I've just been, you know, working the entire day. And then you're like, oh, man, I'm really tired. I guess it's four in the morning now. Yeah. Kimberly, I like trash sometimes. Also, Vinny, those cookies, they're trash. Okay, th th those cookies, though, are trash. <laughs> they're actual trash, and I refuse... I refuse to say anything else about those cookies. Because they're bad. It is midnight where I am at. I am officially 26 now. Happy birthday, goddess of life. Everybody, give, give goddess of life a hand. If I had an applause sound effect, I would play it right now. Uh, Paragon says, I wish I could do that, Benny. Work leaves me so drained, I just want to sleep. Yeah. Uh, I mean, like, I, I'm, I'm lucky enough to, uh, to, um, have a job that, like, doesn't, like, completely just eviscerate me. <laughs> so, um, ye. Yeah. You're always gonna be the werehog in my heart, Vinny. Oh, thank you, Dennis. Well, with that, ladies and gentlemen, I think we're gonna, I think we're gonna close her out tonight. Thank you so much for hanging out with me. Uh, guys, if you're if you're bored, click on Dennis over here. Uh, go go watch Dennis. I'm I'm probably gonna go watch Dennis. He's got Jet the Hawk as his as his icon. Go over there, watch him stream. 
Uh, I'm, this has been Vinny eating a Wendy's pretzel bacon pub burger live on stream and uh, hanging out with you guys. Um, yeah, I'm, I, I'm, I'm, my heart is so full and so is my stomach. Thank you all so much for uh, spending some time with me forever. Um, I uh, I can't wait to see you in the next one. Oh, guys, uh, this Friday, we're going to be playing some more Sonic 06. We're going back to Sonic 06. We're going to have a special live guest here in the office with me. I'm so excited. I uh, I can't wait to, uh, to play more of that game with you guys. Uh, Friday at 5 p.m. Pacific time, Sonic 06. Can't wait. Hope to see you there. I'm gonna love you. I'm gonna miss you. Take care.